When released in 1940, the Bluebird was largely a flop at the box office. That was big news because Shirley Temple had never had a flop before. Temple generally was money in the bank every single time she got up on a movie screen. Now we realize that audiences may have disliked the idea of casting Temple as a nasty kid who needed to learn a lesson, but almost certainly there was more than that. Shirley Temple was 12 years old when she made The Blue Bird on the cusp of adolescence. Although Temple grew to become a beautiful teenager and a lovely young woman, she was no longer that adorable little girl the world had fallen in love with. And moviegoers may never have forgiven her for growing up. Not long after completing The Blue Bird, Shirley Temple's contract at 20th Century Fox was terminated. She did, though, go on to make a handful of additional films. But at the ripe old age of 22, Shirley Temple was out of the movie business, embarking on a successful career in politics, serving as the U.S. ambassador to Ghana and then Czechoslovakia. Coming up, more holiday magic, the story of two nuns determined to build a children's hospital even though they don't have a cent. Let's gather at 